do all skills. Fuck it. Let's just do all skills. Um. Okay. This skill is this one. First talent. Pigog Isange Myonyogin Desang damage got Ishi Percent. Okay, uh, uh if I understand this correctly, it does twenty percent more damage to the person that is hitting me. I think. Anyway, it's pretty good. Um Kungyok Tok Tung Shi Pugyok and Inuans Tang Chung Yok in a jigger. Okay, I'm not sure. I, 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 I'm gonna be honest, like, some things are really fucking hard to read, because I don't know some vocabulary. I can sit here with a fucking translator and translate it, but I'm too lazy. So, as far as I understand, this is like, when I cast this spell, if someone hits me, it, uh, it, get, it gets me some energy. So, definitely this talent is better. Immune monster and 20% damage plus? What? No. 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 Oh, actually. Oh! Okay, that's because of your English. I'm, I'm sorry, bro. I mean, I misunderstood you. Pigyogi Zang. What's Pigyogi Zang? Okay, Myonyok is immunity. Desang is target, damage is damage. Jingahanda is increase. Hey, Vanity Snail. Anyway, it's fucking 20%. What is immune... Immune target? What, what the fuck? I don't understand. Anyway, this one inc uh, gives energy. This one. So. I don't know. Somehow, when you use this spell, your attack damage increases. And it's, I think it stacks up. I, I think it actually stacks up 10 times, up to 50%. If I'm not mistaken. For 10 seconds, it increases by 5%. And the effect can stack up to 10 times. That's fucking crazy. They are immune to Sante Isang? What is Sante Isang? I don't know. I don't know what it means. Anyway, let's go. Let's go. What's this? Actually, you know what? Uh, I won't have time to like see all of this. Let's just check the skills that we can get right now, okay? So this one, 20% less, uh, I think, less cost, if I'm not mistaken, uh, energy cost. Uh, this one... Uh, 10% increase on uh, this energy generation shit. Uh, this one, the first... The first... Um, Attack attacks radius inc is increased by fifty percent. So this is uh, this ability. This the first attack is going to be increased by fifty percent the radius. 
uh, which is meh, not so good. This one is the best talent, pretty sure. This is a shit skill. This is a, this is a pretty good skill actually. It's just too slow. It consumes all of your energy. I'm just gonna go through the skills that I have right now. She's Santeisang is crowd control. Oh really? I didn't know. I heard some rumors that you're that you have ty three type of skills: first with PvP, second grinding. I don't know man, that's just like, that is not true. You can choose whatever you want, you know? Okay, this skill is, I actually don't use it anymore that much. I use stun, but um, sometimes you don't need stun, because lots of mobs are just immune to uh, stun, so. This is the AoE sp spell, I'm gonna show it right now. This is the spell that is casted just now. It doesn't do mu too much damage, it's like 6,000 damage or so. Okay, first talent. Um, five, I mean, energy cost decreased by five. Second one, two second cooldown decrease. Third one gives you 10% attack speed. Um, so I, I chose this third one, pretty sure that's the best one. That's the spiel, spell that I don't use. Okay, that's the different one. This is a pretty good one, this is the spell. Okay, so what it does, first one, two seconds, uh, decrease cooldown. This is what uh, this is the best talent by far, by far. Um, so while I'm casting this skill, uh, if I'm getting hit, uh, the damage is decreased by twenty percent that I receive. So this is a good skill to face tank something. Face tank, yeah. Um, so every time I hit, I get shock energy, one shock energy every time I hit. This one. Shock energy is a green thing. Let's go with this spell. Okay. Mm. Actually, I, sh I could have gone for this one. Let's check this one as well. So if if the target's damage, uh, if the target's HP is below fifty percent, the damage is increased by thirty percent. Um. The CC immune, immune targets get 10% bonus damage. I mean, this spell does 10% bonus damage, which is basically all the bosses. Um, so, the enemies that you hit. Uh, during five seconds, they lose uh, five percent of their armor each second for up to five stacks. So up to, to a total of twenty-five percent uh, armor. Uh, this is the best one, I think. This one, this one is also good, but I actually I don't know if it's good. Like twenty-five percent of armor, is that even good? I don't know how much damage is that. You gotta calculate that. You gotta know the game. I don't know the game yet. D 
this one is attack speed increased by 20% uh, what's a ton what was that Block, blow, hit, knock, blow damage. What the fuck does it mean? What's Takio? I think it means uh, the duration of spell is increased by 50%. Maybe. Okay, I have no idea what it means. It's fucking complicated as fuck. Check this one, right? Oh, I never checked this one, right? Oh, okay, okay, okay. So... Uh, this is the spell that I'm using. S1. First tier increases... Uh, the damage on normal mobs by 20% uh, this one basically uh, deletes the energy energy generation as well as energy cost from the spell so it's basically free to use and doesn't give anything at the same time. Uh, it's okay, but I like this more. 20% just like on trash. Just to kill trash. That's a really good 20% damage increase. Last one is pretty good for tower, I think. Because... Um, so if you use the spell against the enemy that is... That uh, that health I mean, the the health of the that enemy is forty percent below. Then you get forty percent uh, movement speed for four seconds. If the enemy that you hit is below forty percent, let's see. Uh, it's pretty good for tower. I think for kiting for kiting, it's really fucking good. It's actually OP for tower. I'm probably gonna get it if I go tower. If you got, if you, can you guys remind me to get this? I think it's really good. For kiting, it it is also good for PvP if you PvP with this spell. Um, okay. Okay, that's 20% increased damage on uh, immune targets, mean, meaning bosses. I don't know what it means. I don't know. Uh, I think this is... Um, so this spell basically knockdowns the target and uh, this makes the knockdown one second longer. Okay, let's, let's go. Should we check this one? 40% radius increase. Ah, okay, so 40% radius increase on the spell, but uh, if if you damage someone with those additional 40% radius, uh, the damage is inc only 
50%. Basically, you get like a mini AoE for this spell. Eh, it's meh, so so. That's shit. Okay, this is. This is like basically for CC. Uh, you get 25% decreased uh, cooldown and the damage is decreased by 20%. So this is just like for CC bot. Okay, the stun. So stun has one of the most OP things I've seen because you can actually combo shit. Um, first one increases the radius by 20%. Uh, second one, five, five energy costs five energy less. Third one, uh, increases the shock energy uh, generation by three. Um, okay. Oh, so this one decreases the cooldown by 4.5 seconds, but at the same time the stun decreased by four, by one second. I don't know. It's horrible. It's fucking terrible. You can just you can just fucking get rid of this talent. It's shit. Horse horse shit. Um, this one actually increases the stun for one second which is also really good uh considering i mean uh that it, the stun is only two seconds so it's basically 50 percent increase but this one this one is really op this one increases damage oh wait a second i i misunderstood the last time I think it means 100% damage increase of your stun, not while stunned. Then it's fucking shit. What is it stuns damage anyway? Okay, this is shit. If 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 I'm not mistaken, if the target is immune to knockdown, then the the damage is increased by 100%, but the damage is shit anyway. Uh, so this is like uh, if you mouse over uh, in, in the radius of four meters uh, it basically charges to a target to stun it I think uh, if I'm not mistaken, that means a 360 stun. So basically stuns all around you. I think. Let's see what else. What else are we using? This is our A spell. Looks like this. This is actually a talent. The thing that comes up and looks like Shivana. Hmm. 
The first one, when this when the skill is used, increase the. Basically, you jump when you use the skill, so you jump two meters, of, um, two meters away. So it's gonna be like two meters more. Okay, next one is um, five. Uh, energy decrease. I mean, the, uh, the spell. Fuck my life. I can't. I can't. I can't say anything in English now. Energy cost decrease. That's what I meant. Increases the ra attack radius by thirty percent, but when you use a skill, you're stunned for one second. That's retarded. That's shit. Da, da, da. Okay, um, next one. Increases damage to immune targets to knock down immune targets by 25%. This is the thing that I'm using. Basically, you get a AOE, AOE like this, which damages people around. Man, I only have Koreans now in chat, right? Yo, do I have any English speakers now? Or am I explaining stuff in uh, for Koreans in English? Guys, do I have anyone in chat right now? I'm just wondering. Nope. Are you listening to me? No one is like... What the fuck is this shit, you know? Okay, you're here. Alright, alright, alright. Chin chong. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. I got the voice. Um, next one. Good konaniji. What the fuck is that? Let me change it. Uh, okay, Koreans, help me. I don't know how to translate this skill. Anyway, let's go for this one. 전력 전력으로 내려 조적에게 큰 충격을 주고 적이 다운 적이 다운 시 시간을 1초 증가시킨다. Uh, so basically, just increases the knockdown for one second. And another one, just a 30% damage increase on the spell. See, that is the reason why I don't like the tripod system like this is what is supposed to be you know this this thing for example so basically i use a spell not this one this one and i get this shivana thing around me and it's pretty cool you know so why the fuck did you make the spells did, did you make the talents then do don't do anything. They either increase the stun duration, or they increase damage, or they decrease damage, or do make you get get stunned. You know there is nothing cool about it. It's very flat 
It's like basically equip equipping a new item. It's like the same effect. So it doesn't change the spell too much. I don't like that at all. That is one of the main problems with the game right now, in my opinion. It's not versatile in terms of skills. Uh, maybe it is, actually. I mean, you can actually do something, but... It's not... There is no cool effects to it, you know? Like, if you go to Diablo, I, I already told that... I, I already said about it a few times. But if you go to Diablo and you change a rune... Uh, the spell changes completely. It can be a fucking... I don't know. A fucking lightning. And it's gonna be a ball. You know? If you change it, for example. Okay, never mind. Let's keep doing this. I don't know what that, this does too much. Whatever. Let's go to the next skill. This skill I actually don't use anymore. It also it also knocks down people. Let's just check for you. I don't know, maybe there's something good in here. Um, I can show you the spell so you know how it looks like. This is the spell. It also knocks down people. So, attack radius increased by 30%. Um... Skill damage increased by 15%. Uh, the energy cost decreased by 50%. Uh, I think that means like you 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 start walking as you as you attack, kind of like that, kind of like kind of like this spell. This one is, again, 25% increased damage to bosses, I mean to immune characters. Um, skill Sayong Shi Chung Gyok Energy. Increases the, f uh, the um, shock energy gen generation, the green bar, by 40%. When you attack an enemy during five seconds uh, your attack damage uh, attack power increases by five percent and stacks up to ten times which is really fucking good and it's also there is also a talent like this we saw some skill before I think it was uh, the D spell I have no idea what it means. If Korean people can help me, what does it mean? I have no idea. Can you explain this in English? You're gonna upload this on YouTube? Uh, I might, probably. I, 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 I mean, I say many useless things right now. I, I don't translate all the spells, but I can, I can do that. If it's not too annoying right now, whatever. Let's go. Okay, this skill, this skill is E, this is the spell, let's see, Um. so during 3 seconds, with a chance of 50%, or 50, with a 50 percent chance, uh, every second, your attack power is increased by 10%, I think. I think. It actually, it actually, like, the way they describe skills, for some reason, is so complicated. It's, it's not just, like... It's not that easy, you know? I think I'm right.
<clears throat> so the radius is, is increased by 20% and then this one after each attack the if the, if if it crits the crit damage is increased by 50%. First attack first first attack attacks damage is increased by 10%. The next ones are increased by 5%. Again, if you, you, you can remember this icon because it always gives the same thing. It's 20% uh, damage against immune targets as bosses, uh, for example, bosses. Um. This one is two, two second cooldown, reduce. So the last talent base is basically uh, this, this is this is the spell I'm talking about. What it does is the last attack, the last attack's uh, critical chances increased by fifty percent, and this one is basically more stable. It just gives a stronger attack on the last attack. It just it, uh, the last attack is just stronger, and this one has 50% increased uh, uh, crit, crit. So I think if your crit chance is low, then it's probably better to get this. But if it's high, then get this so you can almost get like 100% on it and crit always. But I I can actually test it out. Let's sh let's just check what happens. Gotta get a mop or something. Can I get a fucking minion? Hello? Um. Okay. So. Oh, they die too fast. God damn it. I just gotta make. Try and make the last attack. Fuck. Oh, did you see that? The, there isn't one extra attack. Okay, if it's an extra attack, it's actually probably the same as having a 50% critical chance. Maybe even better, I don't know. You gotta test it out. Alright, let's go. What else? I actually like this more. Whatever. Last one is charge. So, um... What did I do? I don't remember anything, doing anything. Whatever. Let's go for charge. So charge look like, looks like this. First row. Uh, basically increases the charges range by one meter. Uh, in uh, decreases both 50% um, green energy generation and uh, red energy cost by 50%. Yeah, it decreases. Actually, it's not it's not too good because I I, I really like the Chungyok generation, which is a shock energy generation. I'll probably should change it. This is increase uh, increase the radius by twenty percent. I'll probably get this instead. Uh, 
increases the shock damage, uh, shock energy uh, generation by 40%. After using a skill, your attack damage is increased by 15%. This is basically just a flat damage increase by 20%. Increases the attack speed by 20%. Uh, and increases damage against... Actually... I'm not sure if it increases damage by 20% or like does additionally 20% damage. Yeah, probably it's the same. Doesn't really matter, but again, against bosses, it you you do additional damage. So, after you attack, it does additional attack with your right hand and left hand or something like that, I don't know. Just additional attacks. Uh, you have to test it all out in terms of DPS, but there is no, basically, there in this game there is nothing you can test it on. There is no um, training dummies or anything like that, so. No recount like in WoW. Well, it's just a CBT, so that's to be expected. So that's basically all the skills that I'm using right now. There's also other skills, but they're not as good at, or... Actually, I can look at them as well. For example, the PvP skill. I mean, I consider this a PvP skill because this is a... Okay, let me, let me show you. This is basically a... A hook. Like Pudge in Dot Dota or... I don't know. Any other game. Roadhog. In Overwatch. So, oh yeah. Two second cooldown. Decrease cost by five. Still don't know what it does, but actually. Yo, yo, Korean, Korean guys in chat, can you help me translate this? Anyway, let's translate this. 자기가 임용되는 거. 스킬 사용 중에 It gives you super armor during the, the use of the skill so you don't get knocked out of it. Okay. That's actually pretty decent. That's probably the best one out of all of them. Damage increased by 30%. I don't know why would you want damage on this spell. It doesn't do any damage. Basically, it's just a thousand damage. It's nothing. 20% radius increase. Um, after you land your hook on the target on on an enemy, uh, that enemy receives additional damage. 15%. 15% additional damage. That's pretty good. That's that's probably one of the best ones um, here. You can burst someone down if you hook him. this
I have no idea, boys. It looks like it. Uh, it actually changes how the spell looks like. The animation. You actually have to test it out. You can't even tell what it does. I also don't know what it does either. It's just some kind of unique um, abilities here. You have to test it out. It doesn't really say anything too much. <clears throat> I think I've seen all the spells, right? I didn't look at high level talents because they all can change anyway. I can't take them in beta because you need a high level or lots of points. Oh, someone says just uh, radius inc uh, increase on that hook. That talent is. 